All right, what's going on, guys? So we are at the Sacramento airport. Uh, 5 a.m. At 5 a.m. No, we, flight leaves at 5 a.m. He's lying. It's 4, are you showing your grandma's phone number? <laughs> That's your guys' phone okay. numbers. Oh, good. Okay, it's so been leaked. The same thing. Perfect. Unfortunately, my cancer's back, and my doctors told me I only have one year left to live. Luckily, my best friend dropped out of college and is joining me to document our bucket list. Alright, so we landed in San Francisco on our way to Vegas and we found toys. Also, okay, over here. Make a tornado, Chris. I don't know how you do it. Make a tornado. <laughs> I don't know how it works. Just use your magic powers. What you doing over there, Clay? See you that thing that like electricity and all that? Like react to where you touch the screen. Does it? It doesn't. I look like an idiot. We've arrived in Vegas and we have some special friends with us. That's what they called us, so that's what we're calling them. You might recognize them. If you don't recognize them, then they're strangers who took us away in their car. Uh, but yeah, we're gonna do something pretty, what are we doing today? Guys? We are going to go shoot some stuff, I believe. I'm not sure exactly what we're shooting, but we're shooting stuff, as well as video. <laughs> yes. <laughs> so we're gonna be shooting and shooting today, and yeah, hopefully providing some uh, fun stuff, because I know we're gonna have fun today. And I think there we go. a little surprise as well that we aren't too sure about. Yeah, so. shipping clayback in a coffin. Yep. I know it's the only place you can shoot a grenade launcher in Las Vegas. I could be wrong. Just a lot of explosion. Well, oh yeah, yeah. Unless this you're is... in the military or something, right? Yeah, I think this is really the only place, like one of the only places in the country. Why did you want to shoot this explosive device? You know, also here in Vegas, you know, of all places. Yeah, uh, I shoot guns as it is. I was raised in a military family. My dad was uh, 82nd Airborne, so I've just been raised around guns, and I, I think they're pretty fun, you know, in a safe environment. Let us let us film here, believe it or not, uh, despite all the terrible videos we've made uh, in the past. <laughs> but I think because you're here, he's uh, having a little more leniency. Yeah, he's ready to go inside, pick up some guns. Yeah, yeah.
You have a great one, man. You take care, mate. Oh, that's so cool. That is just so cool. Oh, yeah, that was just a sweet hookup. Yeah. Be able to be able drive around in a tank, that was incredible. The car felt like a tin foil ball. Like, if you just loosely packed a tin foil ball and, like, stepped on it, that's what it feels like. <laughs> Like nothing, like literally like nothing. It just goes over it. It's just like, what the fuck? Yeah, it costs a lot of money for to do that. Really? Yeah, did you pay? Yeah. No. I gave him a good smile. Yeah, we gotta go. We gotta go. We gotta go. We gotta go. go. Next location. Thanks. Thanks, Thanks Battlefield Vegas. Thanks, Battlefield Vegas. <laughs> That's the drift experience Corvette. Well, Chris, here we are at Speed Vegas. The number one thing on your list, driving a fast sports car. Uh, that's not on my bucket list. Yep, just like you said you wanted to do the whole time at the airport at lunch today. Please let me drive the sports car. Here we are. Uh, oh, okay, I'm, I'm definitely down. I don't think it was on my bucket list. Yes, but... you know, we're just here for what things that you want to do. We listen. Let's go drive one of these babies. Sounds great, yeah. Chris, are you You guys gonna get me one of these? Yeah, man. Yeah. Yeah. Give us a couple years. <laughs> Give us a couple years. How fast yeah. do you get to? I only got to like 110 or something. 110? 112 or something. Are you gonna just like destroy it on the Ferrari? Oh yeah, I got to now. Nice. <laughs> Did he handle himself all right? Did he handle it really awesome. well. Okay. All right. You have the Ferrari next, right? Yep. Did you ever think you'd hear those words in your life? Chris? <laughs> no. You have the Ferrari next, right? Yeah. Yeah, no, never thought about that. <laughs> so far literally you guys are top bucket list people now for a fact the lunch the lunch was just great alone and then it just started with yeah lunch. yeah you, you fucked up Trump yeah, yeah. You, you messed up that was good enough for me but then you, Trump just, Tower was like you, just, you just keep going up and it's the speed just, racing track was no no the, the lunch that was it. yeah <laughs> Well, I mean, we're uh, gonna speed on out of here to catch our flight. Uh, so, are you buying one of these, or what's the deal? They were giving me 